All right, we are all in, trying to scoop a bounty here. Oh my God, we're all in for the Michael Dublé. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Just gotta fade the king. That's it. Let's go to the tournament where we know what's going on, eh? Because the PLO is just a, it's just a guessing game. Donda. Seven eight hand on a twenty four seven stream. Man, what the hell is this shit? All right, we're actually off and ready to go. Oh, motherfucking right. What is up, Chez? The ninety six of the twenty one months. Welcome back, dude. What am I doing with these kings, Cheza? Guess I'm calling. Danny on drugs with the eleven months. New phone, who dis? What up, buddy? Muted? Yeah, but just for a second. Just for a second. Don't worry about it. I mean, I don't even know, like, what I... This is just, like, straight into a six, right? Or, like, into, like, pocket fives, legit? I mean, do people really do this kind of stuff, like, on the bubble? With, like, pocket eights? I don't know. That's obviously like, I don't even know if it is like, maybe we should just like, I don't know. <laughs> I feel like we shouldn't fold it. I mean, this guy's three Xing and shit too. I feel like this is just a really bad fold. I mean, I still would have had the 18 K, you know, still in a good spot to cash, even if I call and lose, but like, I don't, if people are really doing that with like eight, seven straight draws and uh, like pocket eights or sevens. Cause like, that seems really unlikely. Uh, but we did phase into both of like the phase twos of these 109 phases to 5k. So I guess there's a 5k uh, tomorrow, a 5k big 20 throwback event. And then on Sunday, there is a 5k Titan series. We'll go with the check here. I feel like, you know, similar to why I said I shouldn't have opened preflop, like on the bubble, we're like kind of handicapped ish and don't really want to be putting a ton of chips in with these medium strength hands and i'm kind of scared but he's in the small blind right so like he doesn't really have a three he uh can definitely have a flush a straight but that's it sevens i guess he could for sure have sevens i mean I, my hand is definitely not strong enough to raise and it's never ever in a billion years gonna consider folding so just a nice little suck out from the boys there i mean come on dude whatever i'm putting the sevens in he can have some traps sure i don't give a shit Hold it. Big hold it here. This is a big pot. 22k is huge. Yes, let's go. Thank you, Patty. Two of 19. Damn, who's got more? Oh, yeah, that guy had 110k before. Ooh, but it's only 85k now. All right. Gonna go for the continuation bet. We make the loose open creep up with the 10 9 out. But we do cover everybody uh, deep in a PKO tournament where there will obviously be ICM pressure. And yeah, I think it's a reasonable way to go after the folks. We obviously want to play more hands, take more bounties, apply pressure to people who want to ladder up and try to make the final table. And I'm gonna keep going here. Um, gonna bluff some hearts, gonna bluff some other rivers. We're obviously, gonna get there when we hit a seven gonna be weird when we hit a 10 or a 9 and it's gonna be strange but we will cross that bridge when we get there okay <laughs> damn dude that is weird so like over pairs that he has for value that beat us are like aces maybe kings if he wants to slow play them super reasonable i have no time bank okay interesting he has sixes deuces a lot of clubs a lot of hearts he doesn't bluff those very much, just because I don't think they bluff that much. Aces and kings for value. I mean, I don't really think I was going to check fold. I don't really think I was going to check fold the river anyways. And like I said, I don't really think he's going to bluff very much, you know? So I just kind of determined that there will be a, hopefully enough like ace eight suited, pocket fives, um, six seven suited. Some stuff like that, you know, where he's got like a pair of straight draw blocker and just wants to call down. I mean, the amount of chips going in on the river is like pretty limited compared to what the pot is. Bounty, etc, 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 you know. 
I mean, good flat from him, I think, with aces in this, like, exact situation. Like, usually, deep in these spots, you want to be three betting your aces and your kings or else you just can't really have a three betting range because it's hard to three bet call with like pocket nine safe for, for value here deep in a poker tournament basically but it is smaller field one 23 paid 18 left pko tournament more reason to hunt chips and not worry about those kind of icm shit so uh yeah i, I think it's decent appeal anyways but pretty uh it, it, we, we, weird spot on the river all right, we are all in, trying to scoop a bounty here. Oh my God, we're all in for the Michael Dublé. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Just got to fade the king. That's it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Down to 14. Back up to 74,000 biscuits. Another $50 bounty to add to the pile. Not going to raise the king tray, though. Get the camera, mom. Yes. Oh, we already got a ladder on the FT. I mean, we're on a fucking FT over here, by the way, and we haven't uh, even looked at it. I mean, it's been two hands, I guess, but there's just a lot of uh, action going on. Uh, uh, let me bet so that I can play all of the other tables. Actually, we're here on the final table where we bet really tiny on the flop. Uh, Ace 10 is going to be a check back now. Definitely not strong enough to jam, I don't think. Come on. Yes. So we are all in on the FT. Here we go. We're going to need some help. Most, ah, not necessarily. I mean, he could easily have a worse hand, of course. Okay, chop. I mean, flip. Not a chop at all. The opposite of a chop. That's a fifth place for the boys. Okay, okay. All right, guys, so I have been pestering Jay Nandez to make a PLO bundle for us for quite some time, and I am honored to be able to say that it has arrived. We've got a PLO bundle in the same format that you guys are used to on BBC Poker, so same bundle price, super high-level PLO content. So I've gone through the whole thing, and I think it is absolutely incredible. Uh, Nandez speaks at a very high level about the game. The strategy is informed by tools and software the same way that we break down No Limit. And if you're looking for something that can help you improve at PLO, I think this is the first place that you need to go. All right, we will come up to the big 109 bubble of the FT. Smaller tournament, of course. Very small, 1,800 bucks up top. That's how these things go, man. It's so insanely obvious. Wow, King Jack offsuit. Punished. My goodness, what a gamer. <laughs> We are the chip leader. Very cool. Mark's second as well. Mamet Mori. Damn, what a throwback FT. Hilarious. Mickey! Please, Mark, don't do it. Another check back here or a small bet on the turn here? I think a small bet's gonna, gonna work wonders for us here. What now? Probably too greedy, man. Nine, say, what am I supposed to do here? I guess I'm all in, dude. You can have it. Oh my god, this guy's gonna alternate. Oh my god, that should just fold, dude. <laughs> You want to take your money and a little Christmas heads up? Ooh, a little Christmas heads up. I would, uh, yeah, I should just fold, dude. I'm just a bad player. I don't know. Just a bad player. I'm in love with a girl like you. Wow. Mark's getting wrecked by these two, huh? Hope you end up getting that rake back, brother. What's up, rake? Uh, I did, dude, but I lost $7,000 playing 1K spinning goes to earn the last, whatever, 6,000 points. So, didn't end up working out in the end. Got him. Got him. Got him. <laughs> wow, dude, what a board. Believe in me.
No, she's looking at me. Bold, bro. Never get there. Now I can speed in some hands. Um, this guy is on the tighter side. Of course, we've just discussed this. But, I think that means that he's gonna fold, like, too many good hands, too, you know? Like, he's gonna be ultra nutted when he 4-bet jams. And, like, anything in between, like, even hands like Ace-Jack here, I feel like he'll fold, you know? But maybe he's just gonna call with those hands, which is, you know, pretty fucking bad, actually. And if he's doing that, then this will quickly go out the window and turn into a very shitty strategy against this kind of player. Hopefully he just folds to this. Or she, but of course. Hmm. Hope for a good river, it's pretty good. I mean, it's not like he has king nine suited or jack nine suited or pocket nines even, you know, so. The river's good for us. I'm gonna jam versus Memento Mori here. Wow. I guess I'll just collect the pot most of the time and lose to ace queen ace ten sometimes. All right, we bust one final table, but we make another. Let's make a new prediction. Uh, we'll pay out the truthers when this goes through live on stream. Pay out the uh, sorry, not the truthers. Pay out the Ronin truthers, and we will make a prediction for top three in this bad boy. Want to see what your stats say about people pulling ten percent flop bets? Can't be high, right? I mean, why would why would it why would it be high? Right, I feel like the implication that you're making by saying this is that it doesn't accomplish much, right? Because, like, people aren't going to fold much to it, which is, like, true. But it just doesn't matter, right? You're not supposed to fold to it. It's a 10% bet. Which means that if you're, like, looking at it from a if this bet works, if my opponent folds um, through that lens then uh, it only has to work 1 in uh, 11 times, right? Like, that's literally it. 1 in 11 times, and you're going to make a profit on it. But, uh, yeah, I, I would assume it doesn't have much fold equity, because how the fuck could it? Right? Like, it's not supposed to. Again, it's a 10% bet. You can't really... Like, 10% bets aren't really supposed to accomplish much in terms of folding anyway. It's, of course, it's supposed to fold a little bit, but yeah. ECU Beer Pong, a drop of the 21-month primer. My man, welcome back, dude. Much appreciated, my friend. Hopefully we get this through and he doesn't call it jacks. Queens. It's kind of nice to have a jack, actually. Blocking jacks. Mm -hmm. uh, I got walked last time by this fucking guy, huh? <laughs> oh. I don't see myself holding King-9, dude. Hot, of course. Help me, Dila. Shiver. Not great, dude. Not great. Not a great result on the FT there. 